deep and beautiful space. Again, that long shot. Woohoo! Which is very nicely cut. Uh, nicely cut. Nicely cut by Maris Stauffer. Scazzieri. Irena Scazzieri sends to Farolfi. Oh, great lefty grab from Farolfi. Wind up. Bass has to bid, but she does. She's happy to. But Find Sorrenti on the swing. And that's a hand block on Melaga, but she collects it back after Price Lazarus gets a second hand block on it, and Sorrenti comes down with this one. A lot of pressure by Price Lazarus, but not able to turn into defenses. Farofi with another great grab. What amazing plays we're seeing so far here. Start at the second half. Melaga with the around shot to Sorrenti. Sorrenti puts up the shot into the end zone, and that's collected. Well, it looks like it'll be uncontested as she picks the disc up now. Shamba. Oh, and Helene Rasta Mondial gives up the contest, says, yeah, take your foul, and I'm just going to take it back the good old-fashioned way. Oh, Vera just gets it through there. Kevin, and now that Hauser backhand, Delaval and Kappelman. Kappelman goes over top. Strong, strong grab there to take that one over Delaval and bring it back to within one. What a beautiful take by Kappelman in the end zone. Faith by Hauser all day. Shibiani gets that one around. That one collected low to the ground by Melega. Melega with the shot to Sorrenti. She's able to collect that one on the ground. Sorrenti with the shot to Scazzieri, and they're able to equalize after a marathon point to keep it 9-9. Very important point there for the mentality of Shout. Wow, that was a nice shot by Pierre-Louis Combré with a diving D. Bonfante, Scazzieri, Frangipane, she sends it, Farolfi on the chase, goes down but hangs on. <laughs> Pretty chuffed with herself. Uh, she gets up a little gingerly but seems to be okay. Getting the centering pass, she stayed out here I think for all the offensive points so far. Puts up a big shot to Farolfi, we're gonna get a Chassignot Farolfi battle, who's gonna come down with it? Farolfi snags it out of the air, puts it in the air to Melaga, and that one's gonna count for Shout, 6-4. At long last, we get them back on the board. Kappelman, and they're going backwards a little bit. That one out in front for Egger. She winds up and puts it the rest of the way. Shambaugh's there, she handles it perfectly. And then dishy dish to Hauser, and they cash in another goal. It's a one goal deficit again, two, three now. That was beautiful work by Shambo there. It's not dull. Hauser, Hauser, you doing? Shamba picks it up. Terrison, Hauser, Shamba had space, but she goes for the deep one. Kappelman's there. In a contest, she wins it again. So, Fen Fenrich <laughs> with the disc. Oh, and stepped in front. What a D. And mine gets the other way and makes it count. Great D. Tonelli to Trombetta. Mine with the disc. Hammers. That one counts and the Italian score straight back, made to look easy there, though it never is. Uh, the Italian score on a beautiful crossfield hammer. Instead, Tanita has it. She sees Kappelman. She sends it deep. It's a two on one there. And a emphatic D takeaway by Jacquin there. Nita Hausa, very close now are Fabulous, oh my goodness, how did she come up with that? It looked like it was hammered to the ground and somehow Olivia Hauser's hand ended up underneath it. 
Back to Niederhauser. Ooh, Paula Bass lays out. Barely needed to, but she was so far in front with great momentum that she might as well be sure of it. Get down and get in front in the lane. Uh, a lot of controversy around this proposed rule. Some people like it, some people don't like it. Uh, Ingeborg Kallars, what's your opinion on this uh, idea? I, I think I've warmed up to it. I think I've warmed up to it a lot. <laughs> Alti.tv.